Today I'm going to show you how to build a website in just five minutes. You can change text just by clicking on a text box, double clicking and then erasing what is written and typing in your own text as I'm doing here. So writing my pro guitar lessons then the best way to learn how to shred because this is going to be for my guitar lesson business. So once I do that I'm going to get rid of the things I don't want which will be that middle guy there and I'm going to upload my own image here for my website. Make sure you know where they are. So once I have it in my file manager I'm just going to click insert file place it on the page. I think I'm going to resize this a little bit because that's a little too big. Um, I don't want to move that so yeah I'm going to bring it in a little bit. Move it into place. I like that, so I'm going to click away and continue editing. I'm going to add some text to my page now. Make sure to uh, pick good colors for your text so that it's legible on your website. I'm giving myself a little bit of space to type here. And I'm going to write just a quick intro to my web page. So it's going to be about my guitar lessons and how you have to practice every day and you have to work at it to be able to shred like the pros. So write my text paragraph here. Alright, I like that, so I'm going to give it a little bit more space to breathe. I like the way that's showing. Uh, I think I'm going to change the color though. Yeah, that's better. Alright, I'm going to add another text box to keep everything separate and nice and neat. And I'll use my guidelines there if you see them popping up. See that? Uh, to line things up. I'm just going to put a little link to my other pages and make it so that I can give them more information if the reader so chooses. I'm also going to place a form below in just a minute so that I can take care, take advantage of that offer. Now I'm going to add a border to the top with a white line here to the top of this text box just to separate the content and give it a little bit different uh, differentiation there. And now that I like that the way that text looks, I'm going to use my form builder and the apps. I'm going to put first name, last name, and email address. This is a way to generate some leads for my website. It's just going to cost me a free guitar lesson, so uh, make sure I'll change the text color and make sure it's the same text style and font as my other page. I'm going to move this into place here. Again, those guidelines will pop up and help you out. I'm going to move this just a little bit down. I like it. I think I'm going to make this link now and I'm going to link it to my about page as it's already highlighted there. I'm going to change my link appearance to match the rest of my text. I'm just going to give it a slight different color when I hover over it in the underline there. I like it. So I'm going to get rid of this tweet icon and put in my phone number up here so that I, people know how to contact me. That's a little small, so I'm going to make sure to make it viewable. Put it over there, line it up. I'm also going to use my formatting tools to put it on the right there. And I'm going to make it bold. That white on that background image is a little weird, so I'm going to give it a black color. I like it. It shows up a lot better. Now, the last and final thing for this page, I'm going to uh, I think I'm going to put down at the bottom right just a little tag uh, about my site here. And that's going to be here. This copyright symbol, I'm going to erase all the text next to it. I'm just going to put my little copyright disclaimer, the year, just so it looks current, and all rights reserved. That's it.
I'm gonna press save and I have my web page. That's five minutes on the dot there, so you can see the site live. It looks good to me. Functioning web page. So that's how to make a web page in five minutes with web starts.